previously on Deadliest Catch. 10 seconds, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Let's see, can I reach it? Yeah. All right, Harry. We're in work mode, buddy. Let's go. My butt is sweaty. Make this quick, boys. Time is money here. All right, so grab a buoy. Oh, wait, Harry. You can't do that yet, Harry. We have to move. Then move the damn boat, idiot. Harry, I just want to say thank you, bro. I, I know your hairstyle is, is the new thing. What's going on in the town? But, um, I know you got mod modeling sessions you gotta be a part of, bro. But I just wanna say, you're one of the best crabbers I've ever seen, bro. Alright? Alright, so, this is our last pot for the day, boys. What's up, squad? Welcome back to the channel. We're continuing playing Deadliest Catch of the Game. The full release version. And, uh, we are collecting crab here, man. We have 7,000 in the tank here. And the whole mission right now is to try to get rid of this bait before we have to go in and get more. Alright? So we're, we're doing alright here. Um, so I'm, what I'm going to do is just throw out pots. A lot of pots. And then kind of like fast forward it for you guys. So you guys don't have to see every crab that comes in. And then from there we'll head to uh, Dutch Harbor or the, the harbor and uh, we'll make some upgrades, we'll get some skills and possibly another crew member so that being said boys I'm gonna switch them on to uh, pot setting and get her going Alright boys, so this came from one batch of pots here. Numbers are kinda off. I'm not worried about it though. So uh pulling big numbers here. We should get around nine thousand pounds for this. Let's see here. Oh. Hey, get in there. There we go. Storm's picking up. Should be alright though. Alright boys, we got 9,000. I'm gonna continue on until I can fill this hole up. Pick a different uh, fishing location. Hopefully get better luck. I'm kind of on a shelf right here. Yeah, uh, the though it drops off pretty, pretty good there. And it's shallow as well, so this is not really a good spot to be uh, fishing at. So I'm gonna pick a new fishing location and hopefully we'll get uh, better numbers. Alright boys, the the storm is picking up here. It's gonna get really bad pretty soon. I could tell. Waves are already crashing against the boat. Feeling a little seasick. But the show must go on, boys. We must bring in the, the pots and the crabs here. Alright boys, we're in a rough one here. A little hard to steer. A little hard to maneuver. And a big wave coming up. Oh, it's pretty cool, huh? It's kind of scary though, to be honest. I feel like I'm going to flip this thing over. Alright, my pots are right here on my right hand side. Get her lined up and then we're going to fast forward time. 
and try to get these pots man it's going to be really difficult you can see the buoys going up and down as well hopefully uh, these waves don't mess with our crab numbers here and put it in neutral and then uh, we're gonna wait 12 hours alright boys the the storm is still brewing it's time to do some work in this uh, terrible weather here I think this is an improvement cuz I remember I think during the first episode whoa during the first episode we didn't get this kind of weather I think when they did this recent patch they uh, made these uh, waves more realistic because they're actually scary now. <laughs> Before we were just like going up and down and now it feels like the waves are going to take over the whole ship here. That looks like a pretty good pot to me. Alright boys, so this is our second batch. Numbers are alright. I think we came up like 10 short of 400. So uh, that might be kind of off. So. Um, I'll give you the numbers after uh, Harry's done here. Alright boys, so here are the numbers. Uh, getting a little bit more further apart now. As the season prolongs, maybe it's the bait not being so fresh. Maybe it's the fishing spot. Um, I have a feeling it's a little bit of both. Uh, the bait isn't as fresh. I think that matters. Um, if it's not as fresh, uh, you won't. the numbers will drop off a little bit. Um, but yeah. Let's uh, put these in the tank and keep on going. All right, so one of my subs asked, does it rain or do you get storms? Yes, it rains and it rains pretty hard and the waves can get pretty high uh, sometimes. Right now, this is calm, okay? There are times where it feels like the wave is going to come over your boat and you feel seasick and it's... It's scary because you're looking at it like a 20 foot wave as you're sitting on the side of the deck here. And uh, you feel like it's going to come on board but it just ends up crashing against the, the boat here. Um, hopefully they could implement something where uh, wi rogue waves do come and kind of mess up your vision or something like that, you know. But yeah, so far Harry's doing good. We pulled up our third string of pots I think uh, we're at 12,000 now so hopefully this could get us pretty close we're almost at the end of the season boys four day four days and ten hours so it's looking pretty good hopefully we're doing good in the standing so far so we're gonna let Harry handle this this pot here and then hopefully the weather gets better all right boys that was a little bit better numbers there 217 183 so I do believe that the freshness of the the bait matters. As you can see here, we're getting a little bit better numbers than uh, usual. So possibly get that upgrade so we could pull in more numbers and uh, get more money at the end of the season. So we're at 15 or 14. 14 boys. It's looking pretty good. Should I go after one more? If I go after one more, I'm almost certain we're going to reach the cap point on this. So uh, I think me and Harry are going to do one more before we go back in. We're going to just do one on the fly here. And uh, head back to Dutch and then get some upgrades. Look at that moon, boys. Looking pretty good. I'm really uh, fascinated with how they do the environment in this game. The stars look really good. I mean, it probably doesn't look as good on your screen, but 
on uh, this end you could see like clusters of stars if you could see where I'm, my mouse is pointing there's a cluster right here and uh, it looks pretty cool you know you could look up and just get lost in it sometimes and uh, the sunsets and sunrises are pretty cool and the moon is pretty awesome too sometimes it reflects off the the water a lot and shines like right in your face also like these lights that beam off the, the side of the boat here but man you do feel a little lonely out here I'm not gonna lie like it's just me and Harry and that's it you know there's just water for days and you kind of wonder like what's down there you start like asking yourself uh, what else can we do here and uh, what else is there to see and you almost want to see like some form of life just to make it make you feel like human I guess like you want to see a bird or like a whale splash up or even a shark you know but um, I'm really enjoying this game you know it's came a really far ways from where it was um, hopefully they still implement a lot of stuff I know it's kind of, I'm gonna assume it's still like beta because I've ran into a number of uh, bugs during this playthrough um, just small like like the pot will launch or or Harry gets stuck sometimes and or just like weird little bugs that that kind of crash the game um, I just have to restart it and then it kind of like picks up where it left um, so that's why I say it's kind of like in beta still because I, I don't think it's like a full launch yet but uh they did a lot of improvements like the sky didn't look like this it looked like crap uh, the level of detail on the deck and the whole ship what looks amazing now there's multiple places you could go to now and uh, just get you could seriously get lost bro like I could stare at this forever you know like just it looks like a like the scene off the Titanic or something you know and then um, yeah man there's so much to do here hopefully they implement all this stuff maybe like you have to fix a radar or something you know um, I think the lighting needs to be worked on seriously because like some parts are like you can see are really dark um, yeah you could bring a flashlight but even the flashlights not even that that lit you know um, or make a scenario where where the, the the power goes off and you have to like have one of your workers work on it and it's just like complete darkness and then <laughs> you have to use your flashlight or something you know make uh the boat more interactive should i say um but yeah man we're gonna throw out this last batch and then i'll head out to dutch all right boys last pots in the water and i'll catch you guys in the morning all right guys it's another stormy day out here clear skies question mark <laughs> with sprinkling rain uh, me and Harry are gonna get it. This is the last uh, pot collecting batch that we're gonna do here. And then we're gonna head out to the harbor. Well, here come the waves, boys. It's getting kind of crazy out here. See what I mean where you kind of feel seasick. I feel like I'm going backwards right now. Now I'm going forwards. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Alright, so let's grab this last buoy here. But we lose it. You can see, uh... You stare down this, the middle of the ship here. You can see where it kind of feels like you're moving left and right, backwards and forwards. And you get some really seasick. And this isn't even the worst I've seen where it is really bad. Where the waves are like up here where my cursor is. It's getting there. And this might be the worst, boys. I'll, I'll let you know. Oh, 
Oh man. It's getting rough out here, boys. It's getting really rough out here. We got lightning strikes. Whoa. Yeah. If I had to say one thing about this game is the atmosphere is phenomenal, man. It, it really feels scary to be out here. Oh, I just seen a lightning strike. The sound is great. Could really get lost in this game sometimes, man. Whoa, boys, boys! I think uh, was it Little Mermaid's dad, Triton? I think he's mad, bros, or Zeus? Maybe his brother? I don't know. Neptune, whoever, the gods, the, the sea gods. This is crazy. One thing I gotta say is, uh, sometimes the texturing is off. I don't know if you guys can notice. Let me see if I can do it for you guys. Sometimes when the big waves come, it kind of stretches out the textures in it. See that right there? Kind of like... Moves it in a weird way. But other than that, I mean, the, the waves feel great. I mean... Whoa, look at that wave. Oh, ho, ho. I love this game, man. You, you won't get a, a better, what is it, $10 game? Out right now. As far as, like, feels and simulation-wise. It's pretty cool.
All right, boys. Let's go see what Harry's doing. Harry, you done? Harry's done. Uh, so the numbers are a little off now. Can worse and worse numbers here. At least they're, I mean, they're closer, but the amount of crab we got was very low. All right, all right, all right. Calm down. All right, so we're in the storm. We have to make it out, boys. Let's uh, fill our our hole here with crab. I think we might make the... Let's see here. The full full. Oh, we can't fill it up to the top. All right, you guys get to live. See you later. All right, boys, so we filled her up to the top, or as much as it'll let us. And now me and Harry got to get out this storm, bo boys. It's getting a little too hectic out here. Don't want to get hit by no lightning strikes. Whoa. Let's go head back to the harbor and uh, make some upgrades to our ship. Come on, Harry, get out of the storm, buddy. Let's see. Actually, let's put that back. Whoa. All right, is the hook up? Yeah, the hook is up. Everything is where it should be. All right, Harry, I'll put you in rest mode, buddy. Go chill out. All right, boys, so we're going to hit M here. Everybody's heading back, so we're going to do the same here. It's going to cost us... Mm, only 543 gallons. Gonna get there in uh, 10 hours. Should be all right. All right, boys, we're back, and it is calm and chill over here. So, came back with a full boatload. Let's go to the processing plant first. See what kind of numbers we get. Oh my goodness, boys! Look at this. Well, the the pricing went up as well. I guess towards the end of the season the pricing goes up so that fluctuates so if anybody's wondering if if it changes at all it does okay so we got it's 11.29 per pound now I think before it was 10 something alright so we're gonna get $186,549.30 for this load here hit accept we are now rich boys we've made two hundred thirty eight thousand seven hundred and twenty six dollars um this season all right we still have three days left so there's no holding back here boys so with that being said let's fill up our gas tank because that's just a good thing to do all right i wonder if gas goes up let me see uh i didn't notice but if you guys let me know in the comments pretty sure that's the same. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. I don't know. Um, let's see here. All right. So first things first. Let's go shop real quick. I need. Let's see. We're gonna grab a lot of these. Let's see. We have five pots. I have two available right now. So I need. Let's just grab ten of these. Right. Hundred dollars. That's nothing, right? And that's to repair the pot. So, we don't want to, like, lose a pot. You know what I mean? We want to just repair it to 100%. So, we have something functional. Uh, let's get a couple of these. Just, like, four. Right? And then, uh, let's just get one of these just in case something stupid happens. I know it won't happen, but who knows? Uh, so, this is our what our bait is looking at. Looking like right now. Um... I might use that until I don't have to anymore. So I might go back out, use what I can, get what I can, and then come back in. But we are going to grab more pots here. All right? 3,000. That's nothing. That tote could stay here. Actually, let's grab one just in case. You never know, boys. Um, so we're going to need more buoys here. Let's grab grab five so that's 11 that's eight right um 
yeah let's accept that so three thousand dollars for that that's nothing here let's uh let's see what else we could do here let's go to our skills and we're gonna add another person here two two teammates uh except all right so now we have two which we're gonna go to the bar now and pick a person I'm gonna pick let's pick Stanley what's up Stanley you're hired all right so now I can get Stanley to throw the pots out and then I can get the other guy to um, sort the crab etc so that'd be pretty cool uh, administration office let's go check real quick I don't have any fines thank you Harry for having a great eyeball and let's see here I said I was gonna get some pretty cool upgrades here so let's see keep them fresher let's buy that All right what else do we have here more pot slots and large hatch so let's see efficient bait grinding when you put a frozen block you get 100% more bait so you get two for one basically so that's always a good thing let's see here enlarge your billy basket enables you eh, I'm all right with that keep them fresher let's see more pot slots enlarge the hatch maybe bigger tank hmm so keep them fresher enlarge your fridge Ten more baits inside your fridge. Let's do. Don't want more pots, or do I? Guess I can, can I? Let's get more pots here, and then let's go to the skills real quick. You pull the grappling hook towards your vessel faster. I'm not going to be doing that. Skilled oiler. Thanks to this, uh, this skill. Okay, yeah, let's get that. Sure. Yes. And then what is this? Bait close at hand. You always have the bait and don't need to manually take it from the grinder or freezer. Oh, that'd be good. Yeah, let's grab that in case I need to be doing it. Let's see what else? Uh. Increase the range of the vessel's mini-map. I might do that. Actually, let's do that. Let's do that because I got more pots, so... Just make sure that we know where they're all at here. Eco saline. I don't need that. Skilled eye. No, I'm not going to be doing that. I don't know what tow is. I, d I don't understand what that tow price reduction tow under control I don't understand what that is let's see uh, friends in high places no permission to sell crabs nah raising the limits allowed to anchor okay let's see permanent 5% boost in crabs I think I did that one last time didn't I yeah all right so let's see harder faster let's do this one right and then I have that one let's see own that let's grab this right and then we're gonna go grab some pots here so now we can carry 12 let's go carry grab four of these and uh, one more of these or yeah one more and then that should be all good in the hood, y'all. All right, so 4,000. So we're at 59,000 now, which is a pretty good, solid spot here. Let's go to upgrades real quick. Let's see. Let's enlarge our hatch here. There we go. And that should be all right, guys, until next time we have to go out or come back in here. Alright boys, so that's going to be it for this episode. In the next episode, we're going to take our equipment out 
we have three more days to do something. So like one and a half days uh, to throw some pots out, come back in, and add to our money count here. Uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying this series as much as I am. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys are thinking. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.